I grew up with very limited hunting exposure, but it all started with whitetails in a modest family cabin. In the north woods of Wisconsin, trophy bucks are the prize. But the treasure is hunting camp. It's time with family and friends and time spent in the woods. Our deer camp was special because of that, but it started to crumble after the passing of my father in 2011. It never recovered. Now there are other outside factors, but I pretty much quit whitetail hunting after that and began to pursue waterfall in the search for peace. So to be given this opportunity to hunt a whitetail in Texas, I wasn't prepared for that, and I definitely wasn't prepared for my reaction. I've not got buck fever in over a decade, and I'm, I just about threw up. <laughs> I think I hit him good. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> We're gonna let him sit for a little bit. We'll find him. It's, it's not a big deal. I'm confident you shoot straight. It's a good hit. I'm gonna go look for him, get a recovery. Hell yeah, brother. <sighs> What's it been, 15 minutes? Yeah, 12. 12 minutes. I still, I, I still can't get my wits. Like I'm. <sighs> Very nice. What do you think, Ryan? You know, when when guys cry on film, I'm close right now. I've, it's been over a decade since I've even shot a whitetail, and to have this opportunity, I'm I'm. I'm fucking crying. <laughs> what an absolute specimen. Uh, I just I, I'm just beyond words right now. You know, I've I've hunted all over the world and. Whitetail's where I started, and I've never shot a big buck. I, I've, I've shot bucks, I've shot does, I've never shot a big buck. I mean, just look at this thing. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, boy. You've been rubbing this morning, too. Oh, oh boy. You know, then you hunt to Africa and you hunt out west and you, you know, stalk stuff and I didn't feel like I would get this excited and like I'm like I'm just shaking. I'm, I'm just absolutely shaking still. Um, I mean, I, I, I feel like a little kid on his first year. It's been a decade plus. That's amazing. The last time I shot a whitetail buck, my whole family and our hunting camp was intact. I didn't realize how much I needed this uh, in relation to my own journey in hunting and to my family and my father. This hunt gave me a feeling that I had forgotten. It was special. I don't care if I ever shoot another white-tailed buck again. This filled me emotionally uh, on my journey in life. It was special.